Each spring, a nationwide high school art competition is sponsored by the members of the U.S. House of Representatives. An artistic discovery is an opportunity to recognize and encourage the artistic talent of high school students in the nation, as well as in my congressional district. An overall winning piece is chosen by each congressional district to hang in the tunnel leading to the U.S. Capitol for one year. I travel this tunnel each day with other members to get to the House floor. This is the piece that represents our district, created by Stephanie Lynn from Stockdale High School. Stephanie's piece is titled Child's Play, and her inspiration was children playing on a jungle gym at Riverwalk Park in Bakersfield. She spent hours at the park one day taking shots of children playing and compiled all those shots into this oil painting. Stephanie and her family traveled to Washington in June 2009 for the exhibit opening of Artistic Discovery and toured the White House. Hi there, I'm Don Martin, the owner of Metro Galleries in downtown Bakersfield, and we're very proud that we're going to be hosting Congressman McCarthy's uh, high school student art competition for the second year in a row. This year we're doing it a little different. The uh, show will be on display from uh, May 3rd through May 7th. Um, the opening night reception will be here on first Friday, May 7th, with the congressman uh, showing the students' art, and it coincides with first Friday, which is a monthly event in downtown Bakersfield celebrating arts and culture. All the galleries are open late that night until 9 p.m. Uh, there's refreshments, live music, and uh, local artists set up on the streets. So we hope that uh, everyone can come down for First Friday and see Congressman McCarthy's High School Student Art Show. Hello, everyone. Anyway, my name is Gita Lloyd. I'm an illustrator, an artist. I've been a professional artist all my life. Um, I've made my living doing cartooning and fine art. I don't care what style it is. Um, I don't, um, I don't care about whether um, the student is uh, reaching for like a realism or a woodcut, uh, silk screen photography. Um, I look for certain elements in the art. If you're going to do realism, I look for structure. And I'm, I have a very good eye for spotting that. A very good example of um, a piece that is of the highest quality is the piece from last year. There was a young student. It was immediately apparent to every judge when they walked in the room that that piece would be the piece that would win um, a grand prize. Uh, in particular, uh, what stood out uh, was that the student loved the work. Um, she was imitating um, an artist from the 1930s. Um, she had an idea. She followed through on the idea. She composed a piece um, with a complexity. She did not work from photography directly. You can tell that she went and did her studies, and then when she completed her work, she presented it in a clean and beautiful way. It looked absolutely fabulous. In addition to selecting an overall winner, Gita and other local judges will select first, second, and third place winners in the following categories. Computer generated art, photography, and all other mediums which consist of paintings, drawings, and collages. These winners have the option of hanging their artwork in our Washington office for one year. The deadline for artwork to be submitted to our Bakersfield or Tascadero office is Friday, April 23, 2010. For information about competition guidelines, see your high school art teacher or visit my website, kevinmccarthy.house.gov. You can also find details on my Facebook events page or by contacting our district office at 661-327-3611.